it's me, QP83. I have something really cool to show you guys. Again at Toy Fair, I met with Spin Master, and if you remember previously from the Chicago Toy and Game Fair, they had something called the So Cool Sewing Machine. I fell in love with it then, I saw it again at Toy Fair, and now I have one to show you guys, and it's super, super cool. So this is So Cool Sewing Studio. So Cool is a line of easy sewing projects. This is the starter set which you where you get the actual machine and from there they have magic fabric you can buy and they'll have extra projects you can make. So this is essentially the starter set. So you can do a lot with this. If you've ever felted before, you'll know exactly how this works. Essentially, this is a big felting machine. In the machine itself, there are, there are two needles that will felt the magic fabric together. But the cool thing is, you can't actually touch the needles, so there's no way you can poke yourself or prod yourself with these. You don't have to change them, it's all inside the sewing machine already. You don't have to worry about a child or even yourself getting poked by the, by the felting needles. One thing to note is this does take batteries, it takes four AA batteries, so definitely have that on hand if you are gifting this to someone or if you just buy it for yourself and want to play with it. So this is a so cool out of the box. I already put the batteries in. The batteries are on the bottom of this. You do have to unscrew the battery compartment. I'm going to make a pre-cut cupcake for you guys, but if you are the creative types, this comes with a few different patterns to make cool things like bags and pencil cases. It also comes with some felting fabric here. It's specially made for this this particular machine. There are a couple different designs, so you can do some really cool stuff. So the first thing you'll notice is that the pattern, or the design rather, is only on one side. So you have to line these up first, so you have your design, so the cupcake in this instance, facing outward. Not like if you were really sewing something together where you would try to like put it inside out like that and then turn it around. This is made so it's a little easier. It takes that step out. So you'll just put it together like this. You'll notice on the back there's a one and there's a two and then there's these little crosshairs right here. The first thing you want to do is you want to just sew on these crosshairs. You know what I'm doing. We're gonna go back and forth. Alright, so it didn't do a lot and I only did it here. But now we're going to go to the next crosshair. Just kind of twist. And this is just so when you're going around the entire pattern, the fabric doesn't move on you. So we're going to do this. Step two, we're going to go from, we're going to follow the numbers. We're going to go from one, felt the entire line here, and stop at two. We don't want to do this until we stuff our cupcake. So, step two, I'm going to put this in the sewing machine. I'm going to turn the machine on by hitting the blue button. And I'm going to follow the lines. The needles are rapidly going up and down and up and down and up and down. Alright, now I'm going to stop at two. So we have sewn most of this together. We're going to take some of the fiber fill here that comes with the package. We're going to stuff it. So step three for counting them off is the fun part, stuffing your design. This doesn't come with a lot of stuffing, so if you like things to be really big and floppy, then you may want to invest in some extra stuffing. I've stuffed my cupcake. Now I'm going to turn this back around. I'm going to line up my pieces again. And I'm going to go from two to one. Oops, 
I missed a spot. So if you miss a spot, it's super easy. All you have to do is go right back under there. Here we go. And then it's good. Do you see this hole here? It's not a factory error. There's actually supposed to be a hole in this. You will see holes in the other pre-made patterns as well. That's because this set comes with fun felt pieces that you can add to what you just created. They also have a hole in them, so if you match up the holes, you'll use one of the black buttons also provided in the kit and just poke it in there. So now you'll see I've added a bow to my cupcake. So this is so cool starter set comes with eight sheets of fabric. It comes with three pre-cut patterns here. So cupcake, the owl, the purse, comes with fiber fill, comes with the little black buttons to put the decorations on. And it also comes with a sewing machine. Batteries are not included, so have those on hand when you're ready to start creating things with this. The So Cool sewing machine makes it really easy to make cool things, which I love. I've never been someone that's been good at sewing or sewing machines, so any way for me to not have to deal with all the headaches of a traditional sewing machine is fantastic for me. And I love how simple this is. Now, the biggest con is that if one of these needles breaks or you You've loved it so much that you've used it to the point of it, you know, essentially just being worn out. You can't change the needles. So unless something happens in the future, at the moment, you just have to buy a new machine. So that's the only downside. The upsides, though, are pretty awesome. I think it makes it really easy to make cool projects. The pre-made fabrics and patterns are really bright. They're really colorful. And they're coming out with a nice variety of new things to make. At Toy Fair, they had like a throw, um, a throw blanket, which was awesome. They had a really nice purse. The opportunities are endless. If you've gone through all of your starter fabric here, you can always buy more fabric. These are larger sheets. Um, it's 10 of these sheets that are more than double the size of what you get in the starter set. So if you're one of those that doesn't need the pre-made um, patterns like the cupcake or the owl, and you just want to make your own design, or you went online you found something really cool you want to make, you can buy one of these sets and get lots of different kinds of fabrics. And you can just go wild and make whatever you would like to make. These are really cool. I love the, uh, the feather one. These are just some really fun, colorful patterns. So what do you think of the So Cool sewing machine? You can leave your thoughts down below. I look forward to seeing you guys soon with more doll and toy reviews. Bye!